I uploaded this video a week ago of me smashing a phone, and it's pretty ironic because now my actual phone doesn't turn on. Yeah, so uh, I'm using this as a backup phone. What goes around comes around. Up. Down. One. Today is July 20th, and starting today, I want to see how long I can last by only drinking water. I'm doing this because I always drink soda, and uh, I can't remember the last time I went like a week without drinking iced tea, so there's that. And I'm doing this because I am severely addicted to iced tea. Anything that's not water, not for me. <sighs> ah, I spill more water. I just want to record this so it's on record and you guys can hold me accountable. Like overall, I'm trying to drink less iced tea because that's too sugary. Soda's not really good for you. Milk is for babies. Crap, does that count cereal and milk? Because I'm not, can't have my Captain Crunch without milk. Actually, no, I'm going to miss almond milk. Almond milk is really good. When I was pouring the water, I turn off the AC because otherwise all you hear is this. And I don't really want that, so I turn off my AC. The remote control for my AC says 98 degrees. So just a friendly reminder that if you're watching this video and it's hot, stay hydrated. You know what, maybe I'll just title this video Hydration Nation. That way it puts more emphasis on the challenge and it would be very embarrassing if I just lost. By the way, shout out to Jack who gave me the hookup. Literally he had an extra Wii strap and we like to use this speaker like a lot. And boom, now my speaker has a wrist strap. I mean, I don't know why you would ever want this, but you could also just hang it from somewhere. Doorknob, yeah, if you wanna put your speaker on a doorknob, if you're into that. It's Saturday night, one in the morning, and I'm having my weekly existential crisis. Haha, <laughs> relatable quirky teen. So I go to my kitchen to make some popcorn, and when I realize the crinkling of the plastic is way too loud, I grabbed scissors to cut it open, but by then it was too late. I heard a loud creaking, so it was either that I woke someone up or the Flying Dutchman from Davy Jones' lockers coming to consume my soul. Either way, there was no sign of intelligent life, so I stopped my microwave at one second like a decent human being. But then I found out there were no clean bowls. So I had to make do with a Ziploc bag. Shoveled the bag into the bag, did the Harlem Shake, grabbed the refreshing Capri Sun. Psych, you can't break me that easily. Hydration Nation, where you at? So yeah, once I wiped up all the water I spilled trying to get this clip, I went back to my computer to finish watching some Netflix, fell down some weird 3am click hole on YouTube, and before I knew it the sun was coming up, and we all know how that goes. Three and a half hours later I wake up and I'm ready for a brand new great day. And that's where I told her, hands off my macaroni. <laughs> Alright, catch you later. Oh. Okay, so I'm running off like three hours of sleep right now, but it's nice out. It's a good day. I feel like 